Hey everybody, we are playing Dark and Light again, and yeah, I don't really honestly have anything super planned for this episode, but we're going to play around, maybe uh, we'll get a flying creature if I can level up enough, I guess we'll see. I'm just going to grind for a while, and then I'll keep you updated. So I've been kind of picking at these presents, and there's a lump of coal. I wonder if you put these in the furnace if it doesn't. Okay guys, so I guess real quick, what we'll probably the first thing we should do is make a bedroll and a resurrection altar for our house. Those two things have to be done pretty much right now. So what materials? So we need twine, hide, and fur for the bedroll. And we're going to need bones, hide, magic crystals, and these two powders for the resurrection altar. Okay, so I'm going to get that stuff together okay guys so let's make the bed roll real quick and then the resurrecting altar is a little bit harder but real quick let's place this I guess right over here so this will be this will be our bed Ugh. oh let's get up no 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 don't demolish it I need to get up how do I get up uh, okay, maybe I just get up on my own. Okay, I'm gonna start getting stuff for the resurrection altar. Okay, guys, so to get some of the stuff, we're gonna have to craft a mortar and pestle. So, this is where we're gonna get those two red and white powders from. And those two red and white powders are pretty much made from stone and sulfur, which we could get both of those. So, I'll show you guys real quick how that's done. Let me just run inside. So, let's grab the mortal and prep. Pestle? Pestle? I don't even know anymore. Uh, where are we going to put it? Let's just put it over here in this corner. This could be our little crafting section, right? Eh, you know what? Maybe let's put it right here. Can I put it down? There we go. So now we can go inside of here, put the stone down, and we can craft 77. And that's actually how many we need. We need 75. And we can place that in there, and we could craft more. Now, we're going to need about 75 sulfur, apparently. Do I have any more in here? If not, we're going to have to go get more. I'm sure I have some. 83. Uh, that is perfect, actually. So let's grab that. And place that in there. And then it's just a little bit of a waiting game. Let's craft all 72. So then once this is done... Okay, guys. I'm pretty sure we have enough. So I'm just going to take those, those two things out. And, yep. There we go. Let's craft that. And this will be kind of like a respawn, but instead of respawning in town, we'll be able to respawn at our house. Which could make things quicker, essentially, if I die or something. Let's use this item, and we will... Oh, maybe it was a mistake to put that mortal and pestle there. I guess we'll just put it right here. Bam. And, yeah, we could respawn here, which is cool. Okay, guys, we've got some more chests here because running out of room. Later, when we level up a bit, we're going to be able to craft, like, advanced chests, which are bigger. <clears throat> now, they take up a little bit more room, but they hold more stuff. But for now, okay, seriously. But for now, we'll stick to this little stuff. And you guys might be wondering, oh, you're unorganized. You never do this. Yeah, I don't. I always organize my stuff, which we will. But we won't do it right now because since we're still early game, I'm pretty much going to wait until I get the bigger chest to do anything. Just because right now, I can even if I make one of these chests, let's just say straw, this boy will be filled in like 20 minutes. So there's no really reason to organize it right Okay, well, um, now it's time to farm pretty much. So I'm going to go ahead and take uh, Tusky. I'm going to call him Tusky now. I'm going to go ahead and take Tusky out for a little bit. Okay, so while Tusky Boy over there is out because I overdid it again, let's make the Fireball 1 because we actually haven't played with these yet. And then put that as the spell. So these have like a, um, like they can break. I mean, obviously you could fix them. So they're just kind of like a tool. But yeah, we could kind of throw a Fireball and it does a good bit of damage. Uh, pretty much, I'm not going to be using my sword anymore if I'm not killing, like, farm animals. If I'm fighting something, I'm going to be using the fireball, which is... So, after I get this taken care of and get all the things back in, I think I know what I'm going to do next. One, like, 
thing in the game is obviously to get like stuff like stone, trees, grass, stuff like that, which I can get with this guy. But one thing that I do need to get is like skin, hide, and meat, and different things like that, obviously, and strong creatures to fight other creatures. And for that, I'm going to need a hyena. So I think next, after this, we're going to go to... Okay, guys, I'm pretty much ready to go get a hyena. I've got a bunch of these arrows, the whole stone hook arrows. I've got a little bit of meat, and I've got feeding trough. That's pretty much all I need, right? Now, I just got to not die. But I'm going to go find a hyena, which shouldn't be too hard, and we'll get taming. Now, I have to remember, though, I technically don't have the saddle yet, which kind of sucks. Alright, so we're at level 2 riding. Now we just need to get to the next one. So, one of the nice things is there's NPCs in towns like this, which you can, like, buy stuff from and sell stuff to. So, let's take a look at this guy. Okay. So, he doesn't sell hide. He does... We, we could sell him wood stone, but he, he only sells weapons. Okay, so it's not this guy. This guy sells, like weird herbs and stuff so not that guy i don't think it's this lady because yeah she's like a magic person oh and also we can donate to these npcs for them to get better items which i plan on doing just not right now and this lady pretty sure sells food right yeah she sells food so not hide either I think there's a lady up here. I do not think she sells it either. But we could tr definitely try and see what's up. What are you up to? Okay, yeah, she's also a magic person. She has druid, like druidic armor. Druid armor. Yeah, druidic, okay. I said that right. Soul. This binds... An item near your soul. That's interesting. But can we... S oh, we could sell for a hide. But we don't actually buy it. Well, I don't really know where to buy the hide from. I thought there was a place. Maybe not, though. But what we're going to do is we're going to donate. Let's see if this does anything. Oh, hello. Oh. Okay, so let's go ahead and donate. If anyone, let's donate 50. Bam, he's level 2. Throwing. By the way, these throwing knives apparently are good for getting hide. And right now, we kind of have a surplus of gold considering we can just uh, hit these boxes and get gold from them. If I could, if I truly wanted to, I could just sit here and farm gold forever. I mean, I'm really not in the mood for it, but I could. Alright guys, should we try to get this wolf right now? Just for giggles? Guess let's try it out. Oof, this thing is kinda hitting me though. You know what, maybe... Maybe we should do this later. Oh god, it's gonna kill me. Maybe we should do this later, I take it back. Oof. You know what guys? Let's try it again, why not? We gotta, we gotta remember to place it down on the floor. Oof. Oh my god. Why did, why are they so fast? Like, I literally, they're, they're way too fast. And I keep getting stuck on rocks. These, these rocks literally block me. Oh god, the wolf is right there. Oof. Okay, I I don't think we will be able to. Where'd it go? Hello? I don't even know what happened to it. It like evaporated. Oh, is it out? Oh, I think it's knocked out. We did it. We... Okay, we somehow did it. That is 
okay with me. That was like, it's just, it's so, it's such an awkward tame. Do we have meat on us? Okay, we do have some meat on us. Okay, well, we got ourselves one of these. So, I'm cool with that, I guess. I didn't, like, expect it to just kind of fall over and start taming, though. Okay. What is this? A small goblin gizmo. I've never seen one of those. I wonder what it is. Oh, and there's another goblin. Time to die. Ooh, this one's bigger. Ooh, that thing almost knocked me out. That thing almost knocked me out cold. Okay. Alright, let's go back and check on our tame. I've gathered a little bit of hide, which I could use to make... Could craft ten. Okay, well, we'll definitely get to the Borgesh saddle. Let's craft maybe five. All right, there we go, riding level three. So we got the Bargash saddle, that's what we needed. We might even be able to make it like right away. And we got an Arachne saddle, which we could use on this thing, which I I, I don't see any reason to ride one of those. Those things are uh, hideous looking enough. But let's head over here to our creature, wherever it is. Where are you? You are right here. How are you? Your constitutions. Okay, so he's almost done taming. Still got enough meat. And let's see. Can we make a Borgesh saddle? That's a colossal flat horn, horse, boar. Alright, what are we missing for a Borgesh saddle? Where is it? It's a waterfly saddle, isn't that? Ew. Um, am I missing it? No, it's right here. Okay, we can make one. Okay, so let's go ahead and make one. And then I should probably Google what this does. It's just generic consumable. What do you mean I can eat that? Oh, and it it improves goblin engineering. What? What is this? Goblin ballista? Goblin contract? Okay, that's interesting. So I get those from killing goblins, so should probably go and kill a couple more goblins real quick let me raise this guy's constitution or yeah it almost uh went awake on me for a second there it was really really close but okay what oh here let me level up real quick let's level up my stamina soon we're gonna have to get that flying creature like i said which one is that it is i'm pretty sure no. It's not the wyvern. So, it, it's actually this, I think. Yeah, it's this. It's the Bermuda. Bur Burunda, I think. So, we need to get to level 20 and then level this up to get the flying creature. Which, we'll probably get the flying creature maybe next episode. We're, we're moving at a really fast pace, guys. The first time I played this, I didn't get the flying creature until like 10 hours in. I've played maybe two and we're already almost getting flying creatures so we're moving along really fast okay whoa okay so our bargesh is up same about warwick after league of legends champion and oh why is there like a floating oh doesn't need food okay well, let's give it this stuff for now let's go ahead and get this and then demolish this and then give him the rest of the meat. Oh, and also we got to put the saddle on him. Right? Bam. And now, just like the boar. Okay, if, if I would get on. We can ride him. It, hello? You stuck? Don't tell me he's stuck. Okay. Let's get back on him. Ooh. Why can't I move him? Oh, I'm too heavy. Oh my, I'm stupid. Okay. Uh could probably drop two of these. We I, there's such a waste of like material. But ugh, you know what? Let me take these two back to the house and then we'll grab him. Yeah, I, I did forget that uh although he's an animal he, he can't even carry as much as me, actually. So, 
let's kind of just bring them back here. Let me put some stuff away here. Oof. Uh, let me just throw some stuff in here. We've got a lot of useless saddles now, but hey. At least if we die with an animal, we don't have to worry about making another one. Uh, uh, okay, you know what? It's fine. Let's go and ride him. See, so yeah, he's just like uh, the boar. We can kind of attack. Well, now, instead of getting materials like uh, wood and things, we'll be able to kill animals. Which is fun. I guess we could have like a little test run. Do I see anything? And I'm going to have to level this guy up slowly through killing stuff. But of course, these things aren't invincible. He's bound to die. But, I mean, I guess that's the nature of this game. You just got to build up your army, but sometimes they die. But just like that, he's dead. And then, the nice thing about him is just like how uh, the boar collects the stuff. This guy can collect meat and the hide and stuff. And that little guy is just watching his friend be eaten. So that's not very nice of you. So we'll kill this one too. So yeah, slowly we'll level this guy up too. For now though, I'm gonna go ahead and put him away. We're not gonna need him right now. And honestly, he's such like kind of a low level. He's not gonna do much farming wise. Uh... We're probably better off with our throwing knives getting some hide, but let me put this. Another thing is, if you're new to the game, you always want to keep this fire going to make uh, charcoal. Because it's basically the only way to get it, and you're going to need it for um, like a lot of recipes. So you always want to kind of just keep that going. So I guess I'm just going to keep farming this episode. I'm just going to keep doing the doing. Okay guys, so this is an example of what we're going to be taming very, very soon. One of these. I could... Hmm. I don't have a feeding trough on me. But what if we could manage to grab it right now for a later episode? Where's the feeding trough? Okay, now all of a sudden, I, I just can't find it. Am I blanking out here? Where is it? Oh, it's right here. So we, ah, we, we could get some wood and some twine. Okay, you know what? Before it flies away. We actually, this is a normal arrow. Might kill it. Did I even hit it? I don't think I even hit it. Let's let's make sure to put the torpor arrows up. Or the, you know. The knockout arrows. Okay. No, no, come back, come back. Yeah, and this thing won't kill us anytime soon. Let's see if we can grab it. There it goes. Now it's out for the count. Now, we just need to hurry and get some wood together, pretty much. Let's get some wood together, and then we're going to need some hay. Oh, that is a stone golem over there. Hopefully that doesn't come near us. I need to stop getting this uncommon stuff, because I don't think I can use it. I need the actual wood itself. Alright, level 19. We're actually... We need to get to level 20 to start making the... Flying creature thing. Okay, what are we missing here for the trough? What are we missing? One more... Hey, are you kidding me? Okay. Now we should be able to make... Oh, what are we missing still? Come on. We need two more of twine. Okay. Ooh. Bam. Right? Twine. Bam. Please tell me I can make it now. Ah, oh, finally. And I do have some meat on me. Surprisingly, for no reason, I do have some meat. Now, I could have went and killed something for meat. But it's nice that I have... Let's see. Its constitution goes down pretty quickly. So, we should get this... Oh, oh come on. Seriously? So, we should probably get going here. I mean, we have plenty more arrows. But, I okay, guess put that meat in there. Let's stick... One more arrow two more arrows so let's make sure it's all good now again we don't even have a saddle for it so we can't really fly it but we are very very close to doing it I think it's constitution probably or did it it pro it might have ran through all the meat ah that's disappointing okay well like I said I guess that'll be next episode for now uh, I'm gonna keep farming 
Oh, the griffins have stuff on them. I didn't realize this. Wool. Claws. Griffin feathers. I didn't realize they had stuff on them. Maybe I never checked, but I didn't think last time I played they had anything. Okay, well, I'll have to probably check them more often. Here's an... This is this, this, this level 4. This is the one. Okay, well, now it's dead, so I have no option of getting it. But, like I said, next episode. Alright, that is level 20, so we could finally get the Borgesh. Not the Borgesh, the flying creature thingy. Let's go ahead and level up. Now, basically, we could either craft more uh, saddles, or we could get hide. And now, since I figured out that the dagger gets, like, hide, like a monster, I'll probably just stick to this. All right, there we go. That is riding level four. So we finally got that saddle, which is awesome. Now, I'm just kind of cleaning up some chests. This one's full with saddles. And then this one just started. Now, what do we need for this saddle? Let's see. What do we need? Nope, we need this one. We need a lot more fur. We pretty much have everything but the fur. Okay, guys, so I did a little bit of cleanup. We have about 33 fur right now, and we're going to need a bit more, but we're going to do that next episode. So next episode, we will get this. We will go get a Burunda, which is the flying creature, and then we'll do some flying. We'll see what's going on, but I'll plan next episode where next episode is here. But guys, if you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as a personal channel, and I'll see you guys later. God bless, and... Goodbye.